Rose Syndicate facing off against. I actually haven't seen this guy before. Um, he's a new face to the scene. Who we got on the other side here? We got Morning. Morning. Okay. I thought there was something else there. <laughs> All right. So um, a bit of a, a, a request of mercy. A request of mercy from from the new face here. He's saying, "Please be gentle. Please." As we are here at Michigan Masters 27, located right here in the D, Detroit, Michigan. Well, not really, but close enough. So, just outside. Yeah, just outside in uh, Sterling Heights here at the Lakeside Mall, Joe G's Gaming. So we got Zero Syndicate now with the Sortie organization, more likely going with this patented Shadow Jago as soon as he gets from there to, this guy's been setting up for the past 10 minutes. But I thought I was holding up. That, that, that's a record. That's that's impressive to take that much time to just get set up, just to get ready. To have the ability to build that kind of anticipation is 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 godlike. And also very time consuming. So looks like we're gonna get underway here. We're doing a quick button check as everybody gets get situated. We have zero syndicate. Once he gets ready, he will be sitting on the player one side, morning on the player two side. Looks like uh, Alex, uh, looks like Zero Syndicate here is going to get his audio together, but he may have some trouble. Not entirely sure here what's going on, but it looks like he's ready to go. Okay, there we go. And, oh, uh, well, who knows? Oh, wait a minute. Nope. Are we okay? Yeah, we are. Okay. All right, so of course, zero known for a shadow Jacob play. Morning, a new face, We're looking to see some surprises. Oh, we got one. We got Mira in the house. We live with Mira, baby. That's what's up. I like this. So we got all kinds of characters for this tournament. We got Rash. We got Kilgore. We have Gargos. We got Shadow Jacob. We have Mira. Yeah, we have Orkin. We have Jago. We literally have characters from every single season in the tournament today. That, that is a beautiful thing. No repeat, no repeats either, which is awesome. See, Jimmy will have Syndicate at the end there too. Yeah, he play it. All right, so uh, this is a first. This is a best out of five versus three, and this is on the winner side of the bracket. This is a double elimination bracket, meaning that you have to be not you have to be beaten twice to be knocked out of the bracket. Both players here. Uh, getting themselves situated. And Zero Syndicate is still taking some time to get set here. This is this is amazing. I don't know, he's is he is he playing with his nails? No. He's not? Okay. His nails are a little dirty though. Maybe he should play with his nails. Who knows? Clean them up a little bit. He's gonna watch this and he's gonna hate me. But it's perfectly fine. It's okay. I don't care. I hear a zero, I don't care. I'm gonna make money regardless. Just you just gotta deal with it man. I'm sorry. That is how it goes. And I messed up early too. I definitely said 2000, I definitely said 27. It's definitely 2017. So we're not gonna worry about that. Oh, All right, there we go. Finally on the way here. We got Shadow Jago versus Mira. And a first to three. Zero Syndicate versus Morning. Let's get Zero Syndicate, a well-known face around the Detroit scene. Morning, a bit of a newcomer, so like to see what uh, happens here. All right, opening game, teleport down, kick the start. Nice combo here, and uh, what's the Oki? Tries to go for a grab, but he backs out of it, gets a combo start, he gets a lockout, but he ends it early. All right, some nice uh, startups here. Overhead. Now, Shadow Jango having one of the fastest fireballs in the game. Does have a unique ability to keep Mirror's air mobility in check, but we'll see how Zero approaches this matchup now. He's deciding to pressure her a little bit more. Mirror doesn't have the strongest wake up options, but she does have one very solid option, which is the fist. Obviously, you see him using a lot here, however, the way that Mirror works is that for every special move that she conducts, it costs a bit of her health, which is why she dies so fast. A glass cannon, if you will. So we got Zero here looking to space out the bats using his teleport dashes to get around the screen and to keep Morning on his toes. He misses the surge dive kick, but he gets the uh, capitalization off the whip. Oh, and a nice surge.
surge dive, this nice surge slide for the cross up. And he gets a very active shadow counter. Oh, but drops the combo, but gets the reset. So American, so good. And uh, we have Mary here using that miss to get out of trouble. He gets the opening, goes to the shadow, and will end with a counter breaker instead of a full ultra. So, first game goes to zero. Not a bad showing for Morning. Not a bad showing at all. Just a few drops here and there, but he's definitely showing that he's competent. He's definitely showing that he's here. So we're starting off with game number two. Now he's using the heavy bats here for the increased durability, but as stated before, with Shadow Jiggles Fireball getting to be very quick, he is able to deal with those bats fairly easily. All right, he gets the overhead. He gets broken. With Mira, now Mira is uh, very straightforward, uh, very straightforward in her approach from full screen. As you can see here, her job is to set up bats to cover herself, and then uses her instant air dash to get a quick uh, offensive start. Does the uh, shadow reaping, but doesn't get anything off of it. But gets another combo instead. Gets the wall splat ender. Pretty sure that was an accident. All right, he gets hit for uh, zero to take the first round. Now there you see the fireball game shutting down pretty much all of Mira's opening air options. All right, we got a jungle here, but not, no finish. Goes for the throw, faces out. Now if you're wondering why Morning is doing the uh, instant air dash often in this matchup, it is because it is simply one of Mira's strongest offensive tools. She can cross up, and she has one of the best cross up buttons in the game, which is her air fierce kick. Air heavy kick. However, Zero Syndicate, very aware of this, doing a great job keeping Morning contained, making sure that he does not get any offense started because, as stated before, Mira is a competitive, a fragile one, but still one that can tack up a lot of damage in a very short amount of time. Alright, Zero here is the uh, combo early for the knockdown. Gets the opening off the 50 50. Oh, drops the combo, gets the reset. And it's a level 4 ender, so if he gets this combo, he will cash out for a very nice heap of punk of damage. Attention, Michigan Masters 2017. Signups have begun for the Street Fighter V 3 v 3 tournament. If you are looking to enter the Street Fighter V 3 v 3 tournament, the man in the gray and even darker gray stretch shirt will be the person you need to talk to. Once again, the man with his hand in the air is the one you need to talk to to register for the Street Fighter V. Alright, so for those of you who are listening, we got all kinds of all kinds of attractions galore here at the Michigan Masters Tournament. So back to the action here, KI. Alright, wall splat enter here. Now morning has a bit of a, a bit of a job to do here as he is trying to get offense starting, keeping zero syndicate in the corner. This is plus, goes for a command grab and gets stuff. Oh, and a counter breaker. Now this will not kill, but this will leave Morning in a very unfortunate spot. Goes for the hard knockdown ender. Goes for a jump heavy punch. Doesn't get it, but gets the surge slide for the win. And Zero Syndicate moves on in the winner's bracket as he takes a 3-0 victory over Morning. Morning still in this tournament as he now progresses to the loser side of the bracket where you have to fight for his tournament life here at Michigan Masters. Now, my question is, will he be able to get unsettled as long in as much time, if not shorter, than it took for him to get actually settled? Let's watch. And he is busy talking to someone else. Okay. Clearly, he was not the most prepared you person. Are you still seeking the winners right now? Are you staying with the winners right now? This is the only setup, right? Yeah, this is the only set right now. Okay. Uh, okay. We're going to go through the losers bracket. Because we already got four for winner's side. All right, so we are now going to move on to the loser side of the bracket as we peruse through the Shark Tank, that is losers. And this is here where we fight for tournament life. One more loss and you are out of there. 
where you, where you are no longer a competitor and become a full spectator mode, as the great Yites would say. Still pool play leading up to the top eight of this tournament here in Michigan Masters 2017. So once again, we have Morning stepping back up to the plate as he takes on his next opponent, which we do not know where he is. So we're waiting on that to take to take place here. And we know it's not zero, so we're waiting for him to finally get off the screen so we can move on with the match. So we can go ahead and progress forward. If he had finally get out of the way, because we know zero is just taking all day. Because he likes to be complicated. They say victory doesn't go to the man with the best skill, it goes to the man with the most hardware and the most tangled up chords that Zero here is demonstrating. Alright, so we are now waiting on Morning's next opponent. Let's take a look at the bracket. Ian, will you set that up to MK? Yeah. Alright, so let's take a look at the bracket real quick. See who we got coming up next to face up against Morning. We have Tarzard. Where is Tarzard? That is a very good question. Zero. Call the bracket. Call the bracket. Huh? Where's he at? Yeah, where is he? Where is he? Oh, there he is. Okay, there we go. Alright. Everybody's taking this. Everybody's, you know, got an entrance. Everybody's got a second game. Yeah, everybody, everybody's got an entrance. So, we are now having Tarzar facing off against Morning. Tarzar here, another new face here at Michigan Masters. Sean casing his Sadira earlier against Flip Side Tactics Sleep with his kill and the kill board play. A very tough match up there. We'll see if he can shake off the damage that was done earlier and want to log his board from get himself back on the board and compose himself. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna have Mira versus Sadira. Bye bye me. What's up? You said they don't have a signal. Have it what? You don't have a signal. A signal, what do you mean? Oh, it's not showing? Yo, what the fuck? What is going on? Zero! What you doing to my sister, man? What you doing to my What you doing to my Man? Nah. Damn it! Off? The system off? Yeah, the system off. So who turned off the system? I was looking real hard. I almost cried out there in like two seconds. 